Hello and welcome back to Ableton Life Insider Tips. In the last few tutorials, I've been talking about commands that you can add to the options.txt file. If you don't know what I'm talking about, please watch the first tutorial of those um, because I'm explaining everything in detail there. And um, it might also be useful just to see what you can do with all of those commands. So, and this time, I want to show you another command that you can use, which is called thinning aggressiveness. And this one, and this one also needs a value. And uh, the default is 0 0.45. And you can also set higher or lower values, I think between zero and one. I'm gonna choose 0 0.6 to show you what it actually does compared to the default. Now save. And let's start live. Okay, so let me now show you what the thinning aggressiveness command actually does. Depending on what setting you put it on, it'll either leave more bright points in or elim eliminate more of them. So 0.45 is the average, that's the default. Higher settings means that more bright points will be eliminated, so it will be smoothed out. And uh, if you have lower settings, it'll be more rugged, but you know, it kind of depends what you want. So if you want it more like uh, what you actually automated, put a lower setting in. If you actually want it to be smoothed out more, then put in higher settings. So let me just show you. So let's on this track and, uh, and just record some automation of the volume. And as you can see, because I put it on a really high setting, all of those break points were eliminated. So I just really exaggerated in that case. So if I put in a smaller setting, obviously you would have more. That's it for today. See you next time. Bye.